The University of Texas is hoping to find a specific medicine that could treat the coronavirus. Texans Eugene Cho spoke with them about how repurposing an existing drug could potentially help save lives. That was the aha moment. Bill Williams and Hugh Smythe say niclosamide is a drug they've been studying for a while now. Our research groups have been looking at niclosamide for other indications uh, like uh, a prostate cancer. They found out recently an assessment of 3,000 FDA approved drugs showed that same drug was also one of the most potent antiviral agents for COVID-19. What that means is, is it takes a very, very low concentration of niclosamide to kill the, um, the SARS-CoV-2 virus. So the team is now looking at how niclosamide could be inhaled directly into people's lungs using an inhaler like this to treat coronavirus patients. They say when the drug is taken by mouth, it may not be as effective because the virus damages people's lungs. That's why their strategy is to turn niclosamide into powder, which can then be put into an inhaler. They say they're working on setting up a clinical trial. Still a lot of testing to do, but, um, you know, uh, potentially could be, you know, within uh, several months could be achieved. We're working with an already approved drug which makes so much sense. So we view this as it just being essential. Eugene Cho, KXAN News. The researchers tell us this drug was developed in the 1950s. It was first used in livestock, then later in humans to treat intestinal parasites. It is not commercially available in the United States anymore, but they do say it is in other countries. They're hoping the FDA will allow them to start the clinical trial soon.